G'day guys, we've got a pretty basic uh, calculation question today which involves the neutralization of sulfuric acid. Now a question like this is a pretty good precursor for titration style calculation questions. Um, so if you're having trouble with titrations or you're just about to start titrations, this would be a good question for you. Maybe you need to take a step backwards before you go forwards. So let's see what we have here. We, if it takes 50 mils of half a mole per litre potassium hydroxide solution to completely neutralize 125 mils of sulfuric acid solution, what is the concentration of the H2SO4 solution? Okay, so like with any chemistry calculation question, we're going to write down what our reaction is so we can see what the molar ratios are. So let's start with our sulfuric acid. We've got H2SO4 plus 2 KOH to give. K2 SO4 plus 2 H2O. So you can see here that we've got a lot of spectator ions, these, um, you know, this part of this atom, this part of this molecule, sorry, are all spectators, but I'm not going to worry about that because we're not getting marked on this. We just want to find out what the concentration is. So we're just using this to work out what our sulfuric acid and potassium hydroxide ratio is. So because we have the known one is the potassium hydroxide, I'm going to say that one mole of KOH reacts with half a mole of H2SO4. So normally you wouldn't really have to um, you know, write down this statement here, but you know, it's good when you're starting out just to get your head around it, just to have it written there so you sort of can come fall back on it if you need to. So what we're going to start with, if we now know with what our molar ratio is, we're going to work out what the number of moles of a potassium hydroxide solution is. So we're going to work out the number of moles of KOH is equal to the concentration times the volume. The concentration is 0 0.5 moles per litre. The volume is 0 0.05 litres. And that gives us a value of 0 0 0.025 mole. All right, now we can see here that one mole of potassium hydroxide reacts with half a mole of sulfuric acid. So what that means is if we've got this many moles of potassium hydroxide that is required, it is going to react with half that amount of H2SO4. So that would stay the same color. The number of moles of H2SO4 is equal to half the number of moles of KOH, which is equal to 0 0.0125 mole. Now, we're almost done. So it's asking us for the concentration. So Again, we can go to the concentration of H2SO4 is equal to the number of moles divided by the volume, which is equal to 0 0.0125 divided by the volume. It's 125 mils, so that is be 0 0.125. So the denominator is an order of magnitude bigger than the numerator. So we can just say that that is going to be equal to 0 0.1 mole per litre to the negative 1. So 
you can see that like it's not a very complicated question. There's not that many things we can get wrong, but it's important that you follow a very, very specific set of steps. So first of all, we write down our reaction so we can get our molar ratios. When I started out, I found that this was quite handy to actually write down the statement of this amount of moles of this reacts with this many moles of this. So I wrote that down for you guys today. If I was in an exam now, after all these years of doing these sort of questions, I probably wouldn't write that down for time sort of purposes. But you know, it's a good insurance policy. And you know what, maybe a teacher will give you a mark for that. What we then do is we work out what the number of moles is on our known reactant. And in this case, it was the potassium hydroxide. So this is our known. And after that, we use that as well as the molar ratio to calculate the number of moles of the unknown. And once we've done that, it's fairly self-explanatory. You just work out what the concentration is by dividing it by the uh, actual volume of water or that it exists in, and you get a concentration of this many moles per litre of H2SO4. So again, I hope this video helped, guys. If it did, throw a like my way. Do us a favour and subscribe to my channel. I put out new videos like this all the time. Um, but until next time, enjoy your school.